The housing market has slowed down a little across the country. In some areas, it's no longer that raging boom we saw during the pandemic and as the pandemic was winding down. At the same time, interest rates are rising and higher interest rates means higher mortgages. Yes, home prices have declined, but they haven't really declined much. So the, the cost of, of that house that you want to buy might be a little bit less than it was a year ago, but not, not significantly so. Jeff Ostrowski is an analyst at Bankrate.com. He says Bankrate crunched the numbers and found compared to a year ago, your typical monthly mortgage payment now is 35% higher than it would have been a year ago, which is still not great news for first time home buyers. Ostrowski says this is the time to look at where you are financially. He says it doesn't make sense to buy if you're not planning to stay in a location for five years or more. He says work on boosting your credit score, save up for that down payment. And then you want to have some money beyond that because the, you don't want to be in a situation where you, you bought a house and then you, you need to replace the air conditioner or you need to replace the water heater and you're, you're running up credit card debt to do that. He also says if you are looking to buy for the first time, really look into some of the first time homebuyer programs. Every state has a program that will help you make that purchase. Also, it's still time to be patient. You may have to wait it out another year renting. It all depends on what's happening in your particular real estate market. If you are unsure, talk to a mortgage specialist or realtor. With this, watching your wallet, I'm Rachel DePompa.